Oh hi, welcome in. Come on in, come on in. Yes, come on in. Hello guys, welcome to my room tour. I have done like a room makeover, so if you want to check that out, it will be in the description. The, the, li oh. the link will be in the description. Oh. The link will be in the description down below. Let's start in this corner, right? We've got my little homage to my Mexican heritage. There's little me. Some bags. This is a little heart from San Miguel de Allende. They're very well known for their heart decor. I don't know, they, they're meant to be hanging over the door. This is like a motivational sign from the Tessa Collage kit. I don't really see it ever, but that's okay. Here is a sleeping mask that I don't ever use. I got two washi tapes for when I shower because I like to watch stuff when I'm showering, but then the government won't see me. Guys, please do this. My friends don't do this. It concerns me. My LED lights that are not plugged in, but that's okay. These two hooks that I added, a stupid little ring, some lavender, and light switch with Hello Kitty stickers. And up on that vine is a little butterfly from when I was younger. Here, moving on, following the trail of vines, we have my little golf tag. So the reason why I don't use my LEDs you can see they're they, they're not attached to anything and I can't figure out how to put the cord on there without it like falling down all the time here we have some necklaces I'm really proud of this I don't know why they're just animals I think it looks super cute and aesthetic let's follow the path of the posters down this way We've got, as you can tell, my five sauce poster, my other five sauce poster. So here's my bed. It's looking pretty cute. We've got some two blankets, my stuffed animals, my one, two, three, four, five, six pillows. Um, yeah, I love my bed. I think it's super cute. Oh, here's my nightstand. We've got some magazines. I think it's like Columbia, Timothy's GQ, two Harry Style magazines got my entire one year-ish, not really, like six months of Vogue. We've got some random crap underneath my bed, like these shoes that I have to return because they're too small, my camera bag, another bag, and that's pretty much it. On my nightstand, I like to keep a few essentials like lotion, airpods, lip balm, a pen, rings, and of course, a plant that I'm killing. These things were from graduation. My parents took them, so I just put them there. My phone is charging. <gasps> Yo. Oh yeah. Anyways, here we got a little soap dish with some rings. Um, I did try taking this tag off, but it didn't work and it's all sticky, so that's used to cover that up. I got this plant that I got from Ikea. I also got this from Ikea. I think it's dying. Got some lotion from Glossier. Overpriced, not worth it. I hate this lotion, it's terrible. These two I got from Mexico. Here's one last look at this side of the room.
On my wall, you'll see a combination of Tessa collage prints and pictures that I took from Pinterest and then printed out on either Costco or Walgreens or Walmart. There are a few other little prints and pieces that I did not get from there, like my Levain cookies postcard. I got that at the Levain cookie store. There's a couple brandy stickers in the mix. There's also a gum package. There's stuff down here also, like my golf sticker. Um, yeah, so that's what that looks like. Kinda love it, kinda hate it. I would redecorate, but I'm leaving soon, so what's the point? Yeah. Here we have my desk area, the room here, the lotion, whatever, wallet, a singular sock, wireless charger, camera charger, tape, pens, put my little paper clips and just clips, random stuff, little mini stapler, clock, lamp, my window. Over right here we have some of my art and this cute little overpriced postcard thing that I got. I made this out of glass, it's super hard but I love it. Some more vines. Alright, so down here um we have some wires, right? We've got my backpack. We've got my chair with a little sock. We've got my trash right here, and back there we have a bag full of my friend's nail polish that I have to keep. I don't know for how long. Um let's move over here. This is from IKEA. Here we have some stationery along with miscellaneous things. Here we have hair, but also scrap looking things. Here we have some art supplies. Here we have stuff that I'm selling, so check out my teapot. Here we have some college prep stuff. Um, extra packaging, because I use like 100% recycled packaging, and by that I mean I buy stuff and whatever the stuff comes in, like I reuse it, like my rings from the chamois. This is the packaging and I'm gonna reuse it. Up here we've got some random papers and just like my tutoring supplies. Here we have, this my friend gave me some glasses, my perfume, but also the box in here. We have hair stuff, but my like also my pearls and some other necklaces. Here we have some other random rings that I don't wear as much, along with this necklace, which is not supposed to be here. Um, and then some little leaves that fell. A clip, bomb.com. This paper crane I found in like my choir notebook. Here we have this painting that my parents got as a gift. It's really cute. I think it's from Mexico. Here we have a little blue jay, I think this is. Um, I got it at Scarlet. It's really cute. Over here we have my little small wall of Polaroids and my little watch. Here we have some recycling. Above my bookshelf, I have my collection of yerba mates, along with a print I made, two fake plants, and an inspirational quote my friend gave me. We have my massive collection of notebooks, slash yearbooks, other school stuff. Yeah, and this toilet paper that my friend gave me for my birthday. Okay, so we're getting to my favorite part of the room and we might also be getting to the last bits of memory storage from my camera. So let's make this quick. Underneath my bookshelf are my floating shelves. My dad doesn't want to put them on.
falling for nobody else but you. You caught my eye. This picture that I've painted for junior year, this class, um, I stole this little tile from my school. I stole this little mosaic piece from my school. I made this at school. So now opening this up, down here there is my dirty laundry. These are like um, spare um, hangers, obviously. My wardrobe. This is like electronic stuff which is like my phone cases and my spare phone and stuff, but also my nail polish collection. This is a random makeup slash eye stuff. These are t-shirts. Can you see this one? You can. They're really nicely put. So you've got long sleeves, regular t-shirt size t-shirts. You've got tiny baby tees and tank tops. This is my random shit drawer. Okay, I should be more specific. That was my random clothes store. This is my actual just random stuff that I don't know what to do. I get like all of my trash, but also more SAT prep stuff. Random makeup, uh, other stuff. This is my teeny tiny makeup kit collection. It it all fits in this cute little bag that I got at Tanger Outlets. Got this little box with my name, but I got that. Just got it. Here, some hair stuff, more hair stuff, clothes, 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 dirty socks. That's a box full of cards that people have given me. This I thrifted, this bean baby, and then this my friend gave to me. Not sure why, because I don't really like Riverdale. But, uh, that's cool. Hi guys, so I lost all the footage of me doing the outro because I never actually clicked record. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video though. If you did, give a thumbs up. Comment if you want a book tour. I would love to give a book tour. Um, if you guys have any more video suggestions, I know people wanted me to do a what's in my iPhone video, but honestly, it would be kind of boring, especially because I never did the iOS 14, even though it like got fixed so it doesn't really go through the shortcuts app anymore, I don't think. But yeah, so comment down if you have any other video suggestions. If not, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next time.